just want to drop this one real quick. It's been on my mind for a while. You know, a lot of these white supremacists like to blame Jews. But those same people, not even just evangelicals, but just in general, these people will say they stand with Israel. And the reason why they do this is because, and this is mostly pedestrians, they believe that Israel is a bulwark. They think that it is the last line of defense from Arabs invading Europe. Yet if you walk down the street in Munich, not just Arabs but Muslims in general, you walk down the street in Munich, Go to London, even San Tropez. Go to Paris, especially Marseille, Valencia, Madrid. You go to these places, and what do you see? Everywhere from Athens to Stockholm, what do you see? Halal this, Haram that. Israel ain't no last line of defense, but they like to make it seem like the white supremacist Israelis are keeping the Muslims at bay, and they're not. They're not. That's a goddamn lie. And they know it's a lie. As a matter of fact, the only reason that Europe is getting invaded by Muslims and Africans, but mostly Muslims, well, Africans is because of colonialism. You did that to yourselves. But they also did the Muslim thing. The white supremacists also did the Muslim thing to themselves. You want to know why? Because the stupid-ass British oligarchs fought tooth and nail to destroy the Ottoman Empire. When they destroyed the Ottoman Empire and broke it all up and messed up all those countries for decades to come, that led to people running to Europe. Now, it used to be that you just got Arabs from places like Algeria because of the French, Tunisia, Libya because of the Italians, stuff like that. That's what used to happen. But once they broke up the Ottoman Empire and put all those psychotic dictators in power, like the British put the Sauds in power, the British put the Jews in power, and they put these people in power and they displaced millions and millions of people, they all ran to Europe. So it's your fault that they're there. Don't feel sorry for the white supremacists. They brought the goddamn Muslims here, and they culturally enriched themselves. They did this to them. They directly did this to themselves. And now they're whining and crying. Because it ain't Negroes that make you fuck Negroes. It's not. Nobody's making you do that shit. Nobody's making you go to nightclubs specifically to pick up Pakistani dudes and black dudes or black chicks. Nobody's making you do that. You're doing it because you want to do that. And you're getting mad because it's happening. And you're mad because no one's choosing you. That's what this is. You're mad because they're taking your shitty jobs that you don't want anyway. You did it to yourselves. No one, no one did that to you. You've done this to yourselves. Nobody told your oligarchs to break up their countries. To put their countries into complete disarray. You destroyed Syria and created an economic migrant crisis. No one else. So always remember, black people, these people do this shit to themselves. They'll cut their own face just to spite others, and then they'll cry. Don't cry for them. I see too many nignogs crying for these people, shitting crocodile tears. Fuck them, dude. They're assholes, and they do this shit to themselves. If you look at the history of who destroyed the Ottoman Empire, they did that shit. Just like they propped up Mussolini. They did this shit. They created the Bolsheviks. They propped up Mao Zedong. They propped up Pol Pot. They supported Pol Pot for 18 fucking years. They did that shit. No one else. No one else did. They are the ones who do this shit. Always remember that they're full of shit, that they're lying, and that's what they do. And if you try to take their side, 
eventually, after they get cut enough with their own bullshit, they're going to turn on you. That's why guys like some black guy became a radical centrist or whatever the hell that means. Don't believe their bullshit. They're liars. That's it. Bitch.